Universities in the UK can now charge students up to £9,000 a year, and more than half of them in England and Wales do. Despite the rise in tuition fees, figures from the admission service UCAS show that the number of university applications are at a record high. Over 590,000 people have applied to start studying in autumn 2015, up 2% on last year. Across Europe, many countries offer free education for students. Germany are the latest to abolish tuition fees after a public backlash last year. I personally would like to see a model similar to Germany where last year they made a decision to actually finish with all fees um, altogether within universities and that this should be publicly funded. So my argument is that uh, there should be free access and that it should be based on the student's ability uh, to actually engage with their studies rather than being driven by a financial imperative. The extra money is often used to improve IT facilities, libraries and other aesthetics. Buildings and fixtures do not make a university. It is yourselves as students and my colleagues as, as academics that make an institution. I think at a basic level, provide that the, there is a sort of sound infrastructure in terms of housekeeping, that's of course important. Um, but I think that my argument is that we should be looking more to the actual capacity of students and academics in terms of ensuring that we have environments that are actually sufficient and applicable to the work that we do. With the increase in tuition fees, do people feel they're getting their money's worth? I feel like eight, nine thousand pounds a year might be a bit too costly, uh, depending on like three years of study anyway. I definitely feel like I get what I pay for. It's a lot of money, but it's definitely worth it and I don't mind spending it. I don't disagree with the rise of tuition fees. I think it's um, very much the, 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 the common market, the common place that it's gone that way. And, um, but I definitely um, think they're value for money, for sure. If fees continue to rise, will there be any students left at our universities? Rebecca Clark reporting for Staffs Live.